All right, let's take a look at this body paragraph. You're starting with the topic sentence. You're making sure that you have the topic, which is the open boat. You've got the focus on the one character. Inside of here, you're supporting it with facts, some reasons, or some examples that you found from the short story that you read, okay? And in here, you could very well include a quote. If you include a quote, I want you to consider this. You will have to have a signal phrase before the word for words that you copy from the story. If you are copying your character, let's just say your character's Euler, then that's your signal phrase. Euler says, Euler explained, the Euler yelled, okay? You've got the signal phrase that lets the reader know what they said. You put those words in quotation marks, what he yelled, said, stated, that you feel is helpful, and then you've got to cite that, okay? And of course, the source is Crane. So the actual source of this story is Stephen Crane. So you put Crane in that parenthetical citation. Whereas if you're going to just take some words, word for word, something that was about the oiler, okay, then you've got to let the reader know that it was Stephen Crane who describes the oiler when Crane, when he writes, that should be Crane actually, when Crane writes and then you put in the words, okay? So make sure that you have got um, the correct signal phrase before you write these words here. Let me write this in here, Crane. When Crane writes, now notice I've got the quotation marks there, word for word, and after that, the parenthetical citation should look like that with Crane. So please make sure you include cited information. If you choose to paraphrase all that you found inside the story, you still need this citation here at the end, Crane. Everything I've written about here is from the short story Crane. That's what that parenthetical citation is doing.